So good afternoon. I'm Zhang Onli. Uh, the title is Making IoT Simple, Leveraging iCree and NAPU in a Hybrid Cloud Environment. Uh, first of all, I'm sorry that my colleague, B2, is the main contributor and the presenter. But he couldn't come here because of the visa problem. So I will present instead of him. And thank you for joining uh, this session where we present our solution for deploying dynamic IoT applications over a private 5D network in a hybrid cloud environment. This session will give details on how the, the integration of open source projects such as Napio and Acre can transform your IoT management through the adoption of GitOps principles. So each hour short bio, and me and my colleague B2, a research engineer at Sungshu University in Korea, and our research focuses on mostly on high, hybrid cloud infrastructure and management for general use cases and telecommunications. If you are interested in our research topics, please check the QR code on the last slide. So by show of hand, how many people know Napio or Acre? So, okay, many, many people don't already know about them. So I think many people know Acre now from the last presentation. So, so I will explain the Napio first. The so Napio is a new open source project seeded by Google and hosted at the Linux Foundation. It's been about two years since this project started, and it's already been started to discuss about release four. And Napio is a Kubernetes-based intent-driven automation of network functions and the underlying infrastructure that supports those functions. It allows users to express high-level intent, provide intelligence, and declarative automation that can set, set up the cloud and edge infrastructures, renders initial configurations for the network functions, and then delivers those configurations to the right clusters to get the network up and running. With Napio, the user can deploy edges and their workloads using Kubernetes custom resource and GitOps way. And Acre is hosted by the CNCF as a sandbox project, and Acre extends a Kubernetes resource interface that lets you easily export heterogeneous lib devices, such as IP cameras and USB devices as a resource in a Kubernetes cluster, while also supporting the exposure of embedded hardware resources such as GPUs and FPGAs. Acre continues to detect nodes that have access to these devices and schedule workloads based on them. With Acre, the user can do lifecycle management for devices with configuration and instance custom resources. So when it comes to IoT, the many engineers encounter challenges in automating infrastructure provisioning, deploying IoT applications across multiple sites, and managing thousands of IoT devices spread across different geographic locations. The complex and dynamic nature of IoT ecosystem, characterized by diverse protocols and ever-changing status, make it overwhelming. Imagine an automated approach that seamlessly uh, deploys and configures these deliver devices in real time. GitOps has emerged as a leading try to facilitate collaboration, configuration, and deployment of intricate and dynamic applications. So here is the overview of our solution following the NAPI approach. We have the, uh, we have the management cluster, which has orchestrated a worker cluster and workers through the, through the Git networks associated with each cluster. The clusters are provisioned through the cluster API, so we have tests on OpenStack and AWS infrastructure providers. Helm chart managed through Argo CD, which it also is integrated as part of Napier. So after studying and attending Napier community meetings, we got insight and we made our own based infrastructure about hybrid cloud with Napier in AWS and OpenStack as shown in the fig following figure. So we made management and 5 edge control plane clusters in AWS Cloud and clusters for user data plane in private cloud OpenStack. So additionally, we embarked on a new use case by adopt adopting the NAPI approach to manage IoT applications and devices across a hybrid cloud environment. To achieve this, we integrate Acre for managed IoT-related components. 
We developed our CRE IoT package that are orchestrated through the Napier Package Manager and facilitating their deployment through Argo City. This complex approach enhanced our ability to deploy and manage IoT solutions efficiently across diverse cloud environments, leveraging the strengths of both public and private cloud while ensuring robustness and scalability. So here we register Arc resource as a Napier package as shown on the left diagram. On the right diagram, using the Napier Web UI, the package is deployed as an infra package during hydration of an IoT workload cluster. So in this test case, the management cluster with all Napier control plane elements was installed first using Ansible script. The management cluster is used for workload cluster creation and workload management and deployment to workload cluster about uh, to workload clusters. Uh, after about four or five minutes later, we have a worker cluster created with all Arc components installed with default configuration, which can be changed in the Napier Web UI or modifying resources in the Git level of the cluster. So the, back, the package are tracked through the Git repository deployed via Argo CD and compared through Napier ecosystem. During cluster creation and deployment, we can track the state of resources in our city web portal. So we use the discovering and using the US camera demo guide from the Acre documentation to validate our concept. Uh, from the Napier management cluster, we compare Acre values through the cluster GitHub repository and Argo synchronized resource to the respect respective cluster with each change. By adopting the Napier GitOps approach, we can manage multiple Acre clusters and oversee thousands of leaf devices from a single viewpoint, while also facilitating management and configuration across various teams. The streaming, uh, the streaming application can also be deployed in a similar way. So this is the conclusion. So we mentioned uh, multi-site IoT challenges and show our solution with Acre and Napier. It was a short presentation, but I hope this presentation, uh, presentation can help you. Uh, uh, uh. Oops. Uh. Mm. Oh, sorry. Okay. So you can check our research topics uh, and related things using the QR code on the right, right uh, on the right code. Uh, also, you can download this presentation file from the open source activity tab of our site. Uh, if you have any questions, please contact us via email. Then we will let you know the information as much as possible. So thank you again for joining this session. Thank you.